Hey, it's Arn Locksmith here. All right, we're gonna do a little quick video on changing the battery on your three button Nissan remote headed key. This task, you will need a Phillips screwdriver and a flat tip screwdriver, and you will need a CR1620 battery. If your key ring is attached, you'll want to take it off. It's easier to do this and less chance of you breaking your remote housing. With that being said, let's go ahead and start. You'll have the Phillips screw in here. Go and put your Phillips bit or screwdriver in in there. And let's go counterclockwise and to others. That's to the left. No screw comes out. We'll set that to the side. Go ahead and look around your key remote housing and you'll notice you have this indentation. That's where you want to put your flat tip in and just put it in there and just twist it. And see it just pops open. That's fine. You seen the remote moved. Go ahead and slightly push down on that one with slight pressure and you should be good. Here's your battery. Do not pry where the metal is here. And you do want to be careful. This is your chip. You don't want that falling out. Take your flat tip. You notice the battery pops out. And we notice it is our 1620. We're going to put it back in. These are new remotes we're using for this demonstration. When you put it in, you'll push against the metal tabs here. You don't need a flat tip. I'm doing that so the fingers are out of the way. Notice the battery's in. Your little transponder's in. I like to flip it over, just lightly tap it so I know it's in. We'll take the two halves, put them back together, and just slightly squeeze it and you'll hear it snap. And it did. We'll go ahead and take the Phillips screw, put it back in. And you want to go to the right. And when you screw it in, just get it snug. You'll feel just slight pressure. And that's it. You choose change the battery on your remote. Thanks for watching the videos, and we will have more content to be posted.